Dear Matthias, Introductory Speech, January 28, 2016. At some point, we all have to pick a career. Making such a big decision is more than a little scary, it's terrifying. And this decision is one that's going to affect the rest of your life. Making a career choice is a hard thing to do. There are several factors for you to think about and consider. You have to think about what job fields interest you. Do you want to work with kids? Or would you like to work in the medical field, or maybe the legal field? Is there a certain place that you would like to live after graduation? What kinds of job opportunities are in that area? Or would you prefer a job where you have to travel? You also have to consider what kind of work environment you would like. Would you like to work behind a desk all day, or would you prefer to work outdoors? You also have to consider how much money you would like to make. There are so many different options to choose from, it's easy to become overwhelmed when trying to make a decision. Having to think about your future is stressful. Some people have always known what kind of job they want, not me. I'm the type of person who likes to know what all of my options are before making a big decision. I've had a hard time choosing a career path because I didn't know what all of my options were. Every time I would start to look into the jobs I was familiar with, I would find something about it that I disliked, or I would get burnt out on the idea and lose interest in it. I wasn't satisfied with settling, so I decided to start looking into careers that I knew nothing about. I started my career search by taking a few online job assessments to point me in the right direction and narrow down the career fields to the ones that I would be interested in. My online assessments gave me several different options to look into. Some of their suggestions were jobs I had never heard of, and I was hopeful that I would like one of them. But I still couldn't find the right career for me. I also met with several different guidance counselors at Tech, but none of them could give me any job ideas other than ones I had already decided weren't for me, such as being a lawyer, teaching, or nursing. I finally broke down and asked my grandmother, who was a retired guidance counselor, to sit down and see if she could help me find a job that would interest me and continue to keep my interest. I don't know why I didn't just go to my grandmother in the first place. It would have been much easier. But I guess it's because I like to be independent, and the idea of going to my family for help with such a big decision made me feel like I was surrendering that independence. My grandmother knows my interests and me better than any other guidance counselor ever could. So with her help, my career search finally came to an end after many hours with my current career choice in marketing. I'm still looking into marketing and I have some more research to do before I decide that it's definitely the career for me. I'm taking my first marketing class this semester and so far I really enjoy it. It's a job that I could see myself doing. 